Hello and welcome. I'm Alberto, co-founder and CEO of V7. And I'm Simon, co-founder and CTO. For five years, we've powered the ability for AI to learn new objects. So it could evolve from a generic assistant to an expert that deeply understands problems particular to your business. Like Raptor Maps, one of our customers reducing our carbon footprint globally by analyzing solar farms with drones so they can run a maximum efficiency all year round. Or Dogtooth, who introduced robotics to farming so they can do targeted harvesting for every individual piece of fruit, reducing the food waste by a third. PageAI labeled millions of cells to teach AI to detect cancer at a fraction of the cost, so we can get affordable screening at any age for any type of cancer. Kion, the world's largest forklift manufacturer, is making heavy-duty vehicles understand their surroundings, so the life-altering injuries in the workplace are a thing of the past. And Dia was able to master understanding of ultrasound so that every newborn child, every heart has a greater chance of living a longer and healthier life in any corner of the world with access to medical devices. It's been a journey across 350 companies that made AI their core strategy and chose V7 to power its learning. We saw hundreds of use cases labeled on our platform. And every month, we hear from thousands of companies that want to bring more knowledge into their AI so it can understand images, text, videos, and documents that are unique to their business and to what they're trying to solve. In the average technology company, over 40% of our screen time is now spent completing tasks that leading AI models can solve just as well, and that we often don't want to spend our afternoons on in the first place. Imagine what you would do if you had an extra two days a week to work on what you believe really matters. This is our vision for the future of work with AI at every work desk that can be trusted with scaling repetitive tasks and gives us time to focus on what matters. But building trustworthy AI is hard. It takes engineering, iteration, risk, and lots of time between starting a project and processing your first file. Most AI projects that involve developing model from scratch never get to see their first user until a year has passed. And there's so much hinging on the work of machine learning engineers who compose less than 1% of an enterprise and are expected to deliver magic. In fact, they're the most sought after skill anywhere in the world right now. But what if you could get everyone in the organization to start training and using and applying AI? What if they could independently tackle the workflows that AI can solve today? Large language models are incredible snapshots of humanity's knowledge, but we're often confined to interacting with them in a one-to-one -one basis, like in a chat interface. We can't get them to complete many tasks at scale. They can learn from our preferences and retrieve information, but teaching them complex personalized knowledge work, like reviewing mortgage applications or scoring a sales deal is not easy to do. And when we do get them to learn from our training data, it feels like we can't quite trust AI yet. It can hallucinate, answer in the wrong format and retrieve the wrong data. So as machine learning engineers, we're worried that these applications, which are hard to test, just break without us noticing. We need software that combines the helpfulness of a chatbot AI, the scale of workflow automation and RPA, and the ability to intuitively learn from anyone inside a company. A new class of software, enabling large language models to learn from your data, get better with each use, and run across hundreds of tasks reliably at scale. Most of all, it must be intuitive enough to use that anyone can complete the repetitive parts of their work using the company's approved machine learning models without being machine learning engineers. We call this vision V7 Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think we're on to something. Let's just look in the mirror. Now they can't tell us nothing. Ooh. Go. I think this what they want. Do what we gotta do.
V7 Go is an automation platform for the multimodal AI era, built to solve tasks reliably and at scale. It works with you to understand your goal, such as analyzing a financial report, a customs form, or patient record. It breaks it down into steps that enable the reasoning capabilities of AI to extract the information you're looking for. And once the first task is configured, it can run at scale to complete this task whenever it reappears. Let me show you. I have a 40-page engineering report on a diesel engine, and I need to complete the spec sheet with 30 standard questions. All I have to do is drop both into V7 Go. Now watch. Isn't that amazing? V7 Go is analyzing the questions on my checklist, creating a property and figuring out how and where to find the information within this 40-page report in a matter of seconds. And it's filling them in, saving me hours per document. AI isn't perfect yet. So now it's my turn as the expert human to point out a better way to find this information by editing these instructions in plain English. Notice how we didn't need to connect an API or pick a model to test or write complex prompts. It understood the lines and extracted the right information for us based on extensive training on how to solve similar tasks. And here's what's cool. We created a table where our report is the first row. I can review the inputs and outputs by clicking on the headers. And when I'm ready to scale, I can just drag in the rest of my workday and it takes care of every report and suggest ways of adjusting my workflows to solve this task more and more reliably. It still excites me to this day to see V7 Go produce results across hundreds of fields and for so many use cases. It makes the development of Copilots a joy, and it gives a sense of trustworthiness when you scale on automation. Great products always start from solid, secure foundations. Behind this deceivingly clean user interface, there's a lot going on under the hood. I'd like to invite Simon to tell you about some of the techniques used to turn LLMs into trustworthy task automation systems. LLMs are unpredictable machines. You can very well say in a one-to-one -one conversation like you do in ChatGPT, but you can never trust if you don't review the output. As scales grows, trust decreases. V7 Go is designed to grow reliably as you scale. Every task contributes to the model's contextual knowledge, getting better each time you review or correct its output. And this doesn't require a training script or spinning up a GPU cluster. It just happens as you complete your task. The power behind V7Go's workflows is the ability to break down complex tasks into reasoning steps, column by column. AI can reflect on parts of a problem rather than the whole, leading to a 32% reduction in errors over one-shot reasoning across document benchmarks. This is known as chain of thought reasoning and serves as the basis of V7Go's automations. There's more under the hood. When you load a document into LLM chat apps, the text is injected into the prompt so you can chat with the information. On V7 Go, we turn each document into a database for AI to reason with, organizing text, tables, layout, and images. And let the AI write its own code to query a vast amount of information moving beyond OCR into powerful data engineering without requiring any work or configuration from the user. We call this index knowledge, and it's very powerful. We compared the extraction of these custom forms against two leading document processing providers and achieved 100% accuracy with zero-shot approaches using index knowledge against 42 and 66%. How far can this scale? At V7, we are always proud of building software that is robust across massive quantities of data. Today, we support the highest number of AI prediction in a single file across the industry, with over 700,000 segmented objects in a single image. We're building V7 Go to be just as scalable. Each field is powered by a large language or vision model, producing tens of tokens per second across 10 million fields per project. You can process entire data sets with multimodal LLMs. And this is just the start of our scaling journey. We are moving towards a future supporting hundreds of millions of automations per month. Let's talk about security. For five years, we were handling medical data from hospitals, drug discovery protocols, and some of the most sensitive information in the world in our mission to help build secure AI models that understand private information in your business. V7 Go is no different. V7 is SOC 2 Type 2 compliant, SSO enabled, and for enterprise clients, it can be run entirely on-prem via the Google Cloud Marketplace. Thanks for our collaboration with OpenAI and Google, your data remains private and only yours to use. None of the teachings you bring to your model will ever make its way outside your business. 
To tell us more about scaling trustworthy AI in finance services, let's hear from James in our customer team. James, over to you. Thanks, Simon. I'm James, head of customer success, and I work with our customers in finance and logistics. V7Go has a real edge in intelligent document processing in both accuracy and ease of setup. In the last three months of beta, we've helped fintech companies process SIMs into spreadsheets, scale the understanding of company annual reports, and develop more accurate receipt transcription than commercially available tools. I'd like to show you the Hello World version of one of these projects in two minutes. I have 100 pictures of receipts from our employees, and I want to know where we're spending our money. I can load these directly into Zero, but for now, I'll drag one in. V7Go's index knowledge will work its magic and create a table for this receipt's line items. Within it, for each line item across hundreds of receipts, I want to categorize the nature of the expense from a list of 18 categories, from food to drinks, alcohol, stationery, electronics, and so on. As soon as I create these categories, V7Go will start classifying each expense. I'll also create a price category to sum up my expenses. Check out how each of these figures can be traced back to where they are in the photo. This is known as visual grounding, and it makes LLMs more explainable. Clicking on this figure will take me right to its source. Visual grounding is coming soon to any document or image processed by AI on V7Go. Now I have a template for my extraction, I can go ahead and add the remaining receipt photos. V7Go will go ahead and find the line items for each, assign a category, and find the price. We've extracted 700 line items and standardized all of them. Also, thanks to the magic of LLMs, we were able to convert foreign currencies into dollars. We now have structured data, so I can pass it into a tool like Looker or export a CSV and load into Sheets, where I can visualize our expenses. Looking at what we spent, we're definitely a company of foodies at V7. This process took only a few minutes and only scratches the surface of what's possible. We're tackling some very hard problems out there, so don't hesitate to get in touch with our team and tell us about yours. Thank you, James. We are humbled by the trust our finance customers put in us and the enthusiasm of the machine learning leadership. Now I'd like to invite Andrea to stage to show some of the unique features of V7 Go. Hi, I'm Andrea, head of product at V7. We built V7 Go to make AI simple and intuitive to control, so you can rely on it at scale. There are three things that make AI projects successful the model used, the data ingested, and the workflow. This is where V7 Go brings its magic, chaining data and models together to produce richer and more structured information, giving you control over what the model receives as input and how it structures its output, ensuring your LLM doesn't hallucinate, and saving you from the trial and error of prompt engineering. First, let's talk about models. As soon as you sign up, V7 Go lets you use the latest versions of leading models like OpenAI GPT-4 and Dolly 3, Google Gemini 1.5, or Anthropic Cloud 3. As for data, you can produce multimodal workflows combining text, documents, and images. Each data field can be used as input into a prompt by pressing the Add key and picking a property, making it possible for your models to source data from anywhere in your project. We want things to be even more intuitive than this. V7Go supports single-select and multi-select properties for AI and they're incredibly intuitive. Just list the possible responses you want the model to give, and it will reliably express these options. And of course, in that light, we also support JSON properties. This turns LLMs into decision-making tools that can power your software products and connect to external apps. Our products are best known for their data workflows. They give us a bird's eye view of a decision-making process, which for some customers can span across dozens of nodes. Workflows is coming in beta for V7Go. Here's how they work. To branch out your project's logic, click on a select property and start a new stage. Stages let you expand projects to take care of any edge case, like human reviews, translations, or pre-processing unknown data into categories. With the breadth of skills of AI models, workflows will grow to multiple domains. For example, you can load any document into the 7 go project and let a model decide where it should be processed, depending on whether it's an invoice, receipt, or purchase order. Workflows are built to interconnect with other apps, whether it's your product, a CRM, or any app connected to Zapier, where V7Go integrations are available today. You can try all this now. All you need is a document and a prompt. As you grow more advanced, so does the complexity of your AI workflows. We built V7Go to tackle tasks that require teams of engineers to fully solve. 
and worked alongside our customers to reach accuracies never seen before in record time. To tell you about this, I'd like to welcome Sarah to show us how logistics companies are automating their document processing workflows on V7 Go. Thanks, Andrea. Hi, I'm Sarah, a solutions engineer here at V7. At V7, we like making AI figure out really hard work. Here's an example. This company needs to process 12 types of freight documents, each with hundreds of different templates. They all have different numbers of pages, some have handwriting on them, and they're in different languages. Well, fear not. The way that we would approach this is first we would classify each document using a single select property. Models on V7Go can both read the documents and see their layouts. So this classification step will be really accurate on our first try. For each class, I'll create a workflow stage with its own unique properties. So here I have a bill of lading, and the first thing I'm going to do is define the sender, then our tracking code, a list of line items, and finally conduct a reasoning step, which checks if any of these goods are subject to import restrictions by referencing those countries' rules. And we're done, our workflow is live. Now let's run this at scale, shall we? This company processes thousands of forms every day and I've been spending all my time demoing the product, so I better get going. I'll load 1,000 forms in and watch the LLM begin its reasoning at scale. This short setup allowed us to complete these four tasks with 95% accuracy and with a few more tweaks throughout the day, we can bring it to beyond 99%. Two years ago, this would have been completely unsolvable, and today we can free up that time to build what actually matters. To tell us about the impact on our customers, I would also like to welcome Flo on stage. Thank you, Sarah. I'm Flo, and I lead marketing at V7. For the past five years, we've studied which areas of productivity AI will affect first. Across hundreds of use cases in computer vision and language, we've seen you automate advanced manufacturing, robotic farming, drug development, and increasingly plenty of repetitive office work. The area where AI should be used the most is in freeing up our time to do the creative and interpersonal parts of our job, assigning AI the more clerically tedious and repetitive tasks that don't help us make our businesses any more special. We choose our careers to aim for something worth working hard for and put up with certain parts of it because they're necessary to help our business grow but not always us as individuals. We said our vision for the future of work is an AI co-pilot at every work desk that can be trusted at scale, giving us more time to focus on what matters. And this year, we want to make sure we get as many companies there as possible. Across our customers, over 90% of them named generative AI among their priorities for this year, yet only 23% are using it. Those who didn't cited lack of machine learning capacity and lack of trust in foundation model workflows. We're working hard to change that. And since V7Go has been in beta, the customers that identified use cases for it have doubled every month. By the end of the year, we are expecting the number of inference calls on V7Go to equal that of automated labels on V7 Darwin, a number that previously took us four years to get to. As of today, all of V7 Darwin customers developing computer vision models will be given priority to support to kickstart their first generative AI project on V7 Go and bring their AI workflows from research into production. We've received incredible feedback from you on the promise of this technology applied to your industry. Now I'd like to invite someone who's been hands-on with setting up projects in one of the world's most complex fields, the $7 trillion healthcare industry. Jade, over to you. Thanks, Flo. Hi, I'm Jade, V7's Product Manager for Healthcare and Life Sciences. These two industries are core to our DNA as the first industries V7 built for, tackling the prevention of cancer and affordable health for all. Today, we're proud to have worked with some of the most passionate and forward-looking companies across the industry. Here's our vision for how V7Go can reduce the healthcare industry's administrative burdens. From standardizing electronic health records, to maintaining appointments and rotors, to analyzing patient pathways. Essentially, anything that doesn't involve diagnostics and done on a computer can be streamlined with multimodal AI. In this workflow, I'm ingesting electronic health records in an encoded format. This property decodes them and then breaks them down into individual fields. So I get this patient's temperature, 
test results, medications, imaging files, and so on. Entities on B7 Go are live, so if anything changes throughout this patient's pathway, so will this workflow. They just took an X-ray, which will load into this image property alongside any notes from a doctor. It looks like they have a fracture to the left femur, so this patient will have to be operated right away. The data available allows us to predict how long we will need an operating room for. In this case, three hours. And the expected recovery time for this patient will give us a clear view on wait times. If we have any update, it can be ingested in natural language and V7 Go as a reasoning engine can decide if anything needs to change. The same applies for the administrative and the insurance side of the industry, where paperwork and processes can be streamlined today to reduce healthcare costs and the frustration of many patients. There's much more to explore on how V7 Go will streamline healthcare work, drug discovery, and research. And we're really only at the beginning of this journey. So I can't wait to tell you more about it soon. Thank you, Jade. By the time we see each other again, we hope to have many more stories of how V7 Go helped others scale their business and focus on what's important. Now to switch gears to our creative side. I'd like to welcome Bert to show us how we design for software 3.0. Thank you, Flo. Design has a renewed importance in the age of AI. It's not just to make things beautiful, it's defining a whole new way we interact with computers. Models speak to us in an elegant, natural language. Tokens are produced across time, and workflows tune themselves as they discover the best way to solve our tasks. Design dictates the experience of pointing AI to a task and watching it go solve it. This calls for web components that can be both used by human and machine. We're introducing a new design language that we're calling Mission Control. Inspired by the simplicity of single-purpose electronics, stripped to the bare essentials and combined to form diverse control panels. Each box holds a function to hold text, files, documents, options or code, like JSON. When AI completes a task, it communicates with a color light to tell us what it's doing. When humans work on it, every interaction is mapped to the keyboard for the most delightful power user experience. A mission control panel wouldn't be complete if it didn't cater to your mission. You can rearrange each panel to fit the specific task you're trying to solve so that the data that matters most can meet your gaze faster. At the core of V7Go's user interaction lies a table. Tables are the most flexible and transparent way to visualize a piece of software. It's our starting point in defining a new way in which we use computers that aren't powered by code, but by AI. Tables are alive, updating fields whenever an entity changes state and branching out into workflow stages. There's a long design journey ahead for both V7 and all of tech in developing the future of software. And we can't wait to show you what's to come. For that, I would like to invite Alberto back to the stage. When the first microchips were created, we knew they could do anything, limited only by their memory and our imagination. A device so small, like a genie executing our commands, learning from us and improving through lines of code. This is today's reality with AI. V7Go is meant to learn any task as you develop on it, improving with every piece of human feedback. And it's not just an AI model that learns from the internet, but one that adapts to you and your data. Let's take a look back at what we announced today. You heard about V7Go. It's automation by a chain of thought reasoning, indexing of data with index knowledge, explainability with visual grounding, 10 million fields per project powered by GPT-4, Gemini, and Cloud3, intuitive select properties with no prompt engineering, and multi-stage workflows. All of this works right now and can start powering tasks that let you scale so you can focus on what matters. V7Go is available from today starting from $249 a month per teams of up to 10, 
and it comes out of the box with Frontier model tokens included in the price. For small businesses just getting started, V7 Go is available for free for up to 250 automation fields per month. So you can prototype your first workflows. And for the enterprise, V7 Go is available with single sign-on, enterprise SLAs, and solution support from our integration engineers. If you could delegate one task you have to do today to an AI that can learn from you and that you could trust, what would you ask it? Would it be to complete a procurement form, sift through CVs or job openings you've been putting off, or review e-commerce listings for your small business, or finish those forms waiting for you in your inbox? Whatever the task today, give this a try. Put it on Go and let AI do it. We at V7 are incredibly excited to see what you will build next. Thank you and goodbye.